Hi everyone, this is Piyush Jain. Welcome to my channel, PG Analytics. If you are new to my channel, please like and subscribe. In this video, I will talk about the concept of LOD and fixed LOD. Let's start. I'll open the Tableau workbook and I'll connect it with Sample Superstore. So here I have connected with Sample Superstore. Now let's see why we need a uh, LOD or fixed LOD. Now I will drag the profit first. Let me drag the profit into the rows. Let's convert to discrete and remove the decimals. So right click format, number custom and zero decimals. Now, if you see the overall profit that we are getting from data source is around 286,000. Now, when I add any dimensions into the view, so let's say I drag the category. So we can see the profit is start dividing. So overall profit we seen, it is around 286,000. Now, when we drag the category, the profit is divided and it is coming at category level. So we can see for furniture, the profit is 18,451. And for office supplies, it is around 1,22,000. And for technology, it is around 1,45,000. Now, when I drag any other dimension, let's say I drag the subcategory, the profit is again dividing. Now it is showing the profit is at subcategory level. So by seeing that we can understand the more we start adding the dimensions, the measures or the matrix data will start dividing. So when we add another dimensions of manufacturer or customer name, again, the profit will divide it will always show at the lowest granular level. Now let's see uh, if I want the state, I drag the state and I drag the city. So we can see for a state, these are the different city. Now when I drag the profit, so I will drag profit into the rows convert to discrete now instead of showing the profit at city level i want to show at state level that means if i just remove the city from the view we can see the profit at state level so let's remove the decimal right click format go to the numbers number custom and cell mention it zero so we can see for state Alabama, the profit is 5,787. Now, when I add the city, so I will add the city. Now the profit for Alabama is divided into different city. So we can see now the profit is coming at city level. Now, when we have to compute the data at specific level, there we have to use the LOD. LOD represent label of detail expression. So let's see the first LOD called fixed LOD. I'll open the create one calculative field, give the name fixed LOD. So the syntax is of LOD is it is start with curly braces and it will end with curly braces. Now, first we have to type the fixed keyword. And this is colon. So before the colon, we have to mention the dimensions on which we want to compute the data. So if you see in the view, we are showing the lowest granule dimension is city. So the profit is coming at city level. Now what I want, I want to show the profit at state level. So here we have to mention the column name and what we want to show the sum of profit at state level. So we see that we have created one LOD, fixed LOD. Now I will drag this field. 
So I will drag after profit, let's just convert to discrete and remove the decimal. So we seen the profit for Alabama is around 5,787. So wherever we are getting this state, the profit will be constant. Now, when we add any further dimensions into the view, let's drag the segment. So after city, I will drag the segment and you will see the first profit is divided. The first profit is divided. I will remove the city. We can see for first city, it is 453. Now, when I drag this segment, this 453 is divided into two. So we have two segments for first city. So the profit is divided and the total is we can see is 453. So this profit is dividing based on the uh, granularity level of our dimension or the view. But this fixed LOD, the value will remain constant. So here we can see the value is not changed here until the city name is changed. The value is still constant. Now, when we add any other city or other dimensions, it will remain as it is. I'll add the shape mode. Now this value, the first profit column will, the value will change, but the fixed LOD value will not change. It will show the data at a state level. That means the profit of that state, it will always throw into this calculation. So let's summarize it. Whenever we have to compute the data at a specific level, we have to use the LOD. I hope you like this video. Please like and subscribe. Thank you.